That 14-year-old student has since been charged with possession of a weapon on school grounds. Just one of several incidents within the past year of children bringing weapons to schools. Now, while officials say they've upgraded security and safety measures, they are now looking into a specific type of technology. I've never been a strong supporter of this type of of device, I certainly right now in, in our society understand the need. In this recent school board meeting, members discuss installing scanners like this. They would detect weapons when a kid walks through the door. Many officials support it as a way to help prevent a tragedy. And whatever it takes in the budget to make that happen, uh, to get that technology. School safety has been top of mind with more measures in place, but Alexandria City Public Schools is considering weapon detectors, similar to what Osborne High School in Manassas started using this week. Of the 188 incidents the first half of this school year, 15 involved weapons, mostly knives. Last school year, the total was 28. Just one day ago, a teacher alerted authorities when a 14-year-old student brought an unloaded gun. I kind of don't want it. Um, it sounds scary having to go through like a metal detecting thing. The student says she and other kids would feel more unsafe with the scanners, but her parent disagrees. She says that we shouldn't normalize carrying guns, tasers, any th weapons. The school district is asking for community feedback through an online survey. We have a link to that on WSA9.com. The results will then be presented at next week's school board meeting. The school board also already approved a pilot program to bring this technology to the school district at the end of the school year, although officials have not announced which schools are participating. In Alexandria tonight, Matthew Torres, WUSA 9.